what's happening youtube's boy tech tricks back in another video and today we are recording with the mirfac audio tu1 here we go first things first make sure to hit that subscribe button below hit the notification bell to give notified next videos to come with tips and tricks and unboxing just like this one today we're going to show you how to install this unbox this and review it for you guys let me know in the comments below if it's any good or not. Uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this. Here we go. Today we're looking at the Mirfac Audio TU1 and basically it's a condenser USB microphone for, um, I think it has a few different um, accessories as well. We'll see how it goes as we open this up. Oh, there you go. Now there's a few things that comes with, and you can see a little, I don't actually know what it, what this is called. Let me know in the comments below if you know what this is called. Yeah, little accessories for the mic. USB right here. There you go. Some literature. Foam. Very nice. It's also the uh, cradle right here. Very nice. There you go. There's also the mount when you use for your table or something like that. I bet you if you are a twi Twitch streamer, you'll be able to use one of these. And um, yeah, everything that you need here, everything that you need is all in one. Uh, this is an all in one solution for what you need. Look at that. There you go. Very nice. So, so this little thing right here. There you go. Hmm. Little stand. There you go. Very nice. There's also the arm that it comes with. There you go. Put this out. There you go. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Premium stuff, right? And the actual condenser mic. There you go. Now, today we're going to test this out using our uh, MacBook Air M1 um, and let's see how well it does. So here it is, we have set up the arm for the Mirfac Audio TU1 and it also comes with this kind of cradle instead if you just prefer it having it on the, on the table like that instead of having it mounted on the table. There's also the foam that you can use so that you can mount it on top like this, just like that. Very nice. And then um, these are adjustable to however you like. There's a uh, arm that goes everywhere, right? Um, it adjusts to however you like, like I said. And then once you're done, you just tighten it up and you'll be good to go. Now, there's also this guy right here, which you can install anywhere right here so you can have it um, pointed to you just like that like if you're a singer you need this kind of uh, equipment so this that, that is really good for that we're not going to install that today we're just gonna show you how to install it with our macbook air m1 so we're just gonna take the cable that it comes with this is a usb b and a usb a so you'll need an adapter for this because the uh, new MacBooks only has USB-C. If you ever do buy a cable, um, buy one that has a USB-C end and a USB-B end. So there you go. There you go, like so. Boom. We're gonna open up our MacBook right here. Set it up right there. And then we're gonna plug in the USB to the hub. Now let's go ahead and test this out and record our audio so that you guys can hear. Now like I said earlier, you can add in uh, headphones on this, use it as a monitor. There you go, and then place this in your ears like so. Check, check, check. We can lower down the volume. There you go. Right now we are just using the quarter, quarter ways on the volume here. It's pretty loud already, so. And there you go. Very nice. Right now um, I can hear myself on the... And the audio so that's pretty good very nice 
Now we're going to test out the audio and how well it does. Once we are on our Mac, what you need to do is go to sound preference. Once you click that, you can go to input and click USB auto device. You can go to the output as well and click the USB audio device as well. So you can use the monitor built in on the mic. Next up is to open up OBS. If you are using OBS to stream on Twitch, if you are Streamlabs OBS, the exact same way, except it's just Streamlabs. So let's open up that and go to music, music and aux and go to uh, properties. And then once you are on that, make sure to select the USB audio device. Okay, now we are in our OBS and basically I'm using the USB mic. Let me know what you think in the comments below if it's any good or not. So yeah, I'm using OBS right now. I have the Panasonic G9 connected to a USB HDMI converter so that I can get it and use the OBS as my main source of audio and video. The TU1 by Mirfac Audio is also connected to my MacBook Air M1. As you can see, it's doing really well. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below of the quality as well. Now we're going to test out how far and how loud this can get. As you can see, this is the one thing that when you put your hand there, there's going to be a static. I don't know if you guys can hear that on the recording. But yeah. So when we increase it, there you go. You're going to be able to hear more and more. There you go. I'm gonna go halfway there you go very nice the other thing that it has as well I'm not gonna go any more than that it picks up very well right so I don't wanna I don't wanna ruin the mic or anything like that but yeah this is just halfway and it's really loud I'm trying to whisper now because um, uh, on my monitor it's really loud already so We're gonna put it. We're gonna put it back on um, quarter ways, and um, and see how well it does. There's also another knob here that you guys want to look at. This is echo. Check, check, check. So there you go. This is the echo. Um, this is the echo knob that I have here. Where um, what we'll do is we're gonna we're gonna increase more of that echo. There you go, that's the echo about halfway. Let me know what you think in the comments below if that's any good or not, if that's really cool. Um, I don't know if I'm really gonna use that. Maybe on a bigger um, auditorium or something like that, but for normal vlogging use, you might not even use that for twitching or for, uh, for Twitch or something like that. You might not use that, right? So there's also this button right here where you can mute When you unmute it, you'll be able to hear me again. There's a lot of features that the Mirfac Audio TU1 has. And uh, let me know in the comments below if that's something that will be useful for you when you are vlogging. Like I said, there's different types of mounts. I like how it comes with a cradle as well like this. And it comes with this little gadget as well. Uh, thanks for watching everyone. I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a mere fact audio TU1. If I was able to help you, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Hit that notification bell so you can notify when next videos come of tips and tricks and unboxing just like this one. Check out merch below at 1130.ca if you want to get one of these. I'll link this down below as well. Go ahead and check it out. I would recommend it for people who are starting to vlog or maybe people who wants to uh, stream who wants great audio for their YouTube channel, who wants to start off their uh, Twitch careers, um, this is definitely recommended for you guys. Again, I'll see you in the comments below and have a, have a good one. Peace.